This is verse 12 of the 15th chapter of the Gospel of Matthew. Jesus has wrapped up his conversation with the Pharisees and also given instruction to the people with respect to the Pharisees and their attitudes, and now at a later time, apparently, probably in a more private situation, uh, the disciples have a conversation with Jesus about that uh, prior uh, remark that Jesus had made concerning the Pharisees. So we have uh, tota, an indeclinable added, uh, adverb, it means and then, pros eothontes, aorist participle, masculine, plural, nominative, referring to the disciples here. It's aorist, so it's uh, the disciples having come, pros erkamai, to come to. So the disciples having come to uh, him, auto is uh, uh, the object of this, uh, they having come to him saying, Legosin, so they uh, approach him now in a private gathering, I'm assuming, uh, to say to him uh, their perception of what had taken place. And we have uh, oidos, this is the perfect of Edo. Edo means I see, but it uh, normally in the New Testament uh, stands for the idea of seeing something as in knowing it. This is the perfect, so uh, <clears throat> you know and continue to know would be the idea. Second person singular, perfect active indicative. You know, hoti, conjunction, that, hoi, pharisaioi, the Pharisees, ekusantes, from a kuo, I hear, it's an aorist participle, having heard, the Pharisees having heard, tone logo, the word, having heard this word that you said, presumably the word, that Jesus had said to the uh, to the uh, people that were there, not to the Pharisees directly, it may have included that, but the Pharisees were very concerned to protect their status. And of course, remarks that were made to the uh, people that would, might uh, have a, an effect of uh, reducing, of uh, sabotaging their status was of a particular importance to them. So the disciples say they were a scandalous they said, from scandalizo, Scandalizo means I stumble. Uh, from that it can mean I offend, would be the notion. This is the third person uh, plural aorist passive, so they were caused to stumble. They were offended, would be the idea. So uh, uh, almost as if the disciples uh, wondered if Jesus was quite aware of the hornet's nest that he had stirred up by the comments that he had made to the people. And of course, Jesus will clarify uh, how much he's concerned about that in the ensuing remarks, but <clears throat> one way or another the disciples had probably seen it in their facial expressions that the comments made by Jesus had not, won with, uh, had not met with much approval uh, on their part.